Hi, it's Matt here. I um, just want to talk to you today about iPage. Um, I say iPage, it's iPage.com for web hosting. Um, I'm changing hosts at the moment from my um, dedicated server to taking on some multiple uh, shared accounts to split up some of my sites, but also I'm reducing the number of websites that I have. Um, because I find it difficult to maintain because I don't have the spare time anymore. But what I wanted to say was, though, um, iPage is only doing hosting from a dollar a month at the moment if you go for the two-year package. Um, that's unlimited web space, unlimited hosting, uh, unlimited domains, but yeah, there's always limitations. Uh, so I check their uh, policies to see where um, you can actually uh, hit their limits because there are limits. Uh, the, in unlimited, they never make it quite clear where the limits are until you actually hit them. Um, I know with uh, HostGator, it's iNodes um, and my SPO databases because uh, I worked with HostGator previously and now I'm trying iPage.com because um, we're moving off my current hosting package. Um, so what, what can I tell you about iPage? Well, the first thing is they don't use a standard cPanel setup, which for me is a bit more complicated than I'd like to be doing. But it, everything's there, it's just not where you expect it to be, so it just takes a bit of moving around to put everything where you want it. Um, but their support's pretty good. If you're not in a rush, send them an email. But if you want a response in the next like hour, I'd recommend going on the web chat um, because I know the uh, emails I've sent, it took like several hours to respond. But on the web chat, it normally takes about 10 to 20 minutes to get a response out of it. But once I've got hold of them, they, they do everything online. So depending on how critical it is to you, I would say use their uh, support in a considerate manner. You know, if it, if it really needs to be done now, I would go on the web chat, but if it's something you're not going to sort out till tomorrow morning, I'd recommend doing it on the email chat, which also keeps a record of the solution that you found. Um, but yeah, it's at a dollar, um, dollar a month, <laughs> you can't really grumble. Um, but I'm moving about 10 sites onto it, and I'm going to give it a go, but so far I've had no problems with them. Uh, some of the technical stuff that I've asked hosts previously to help me with, um, they normally fix it, but I won't tell you what they did. But so far, everything I've asked for from iPage, they've gone through and said, Matt, this is what we did, or this is how you do that. They're not grumbling about, <laughs> about me asking for excess information. The reason I ask for the um, the technical information, by the way, is A, I understand it, but B, I have multiple sites, so it may not be relevant to, um, they may not, sorry, they may not see the relevance to me asking the question of how they do it initially until I ask them 10 times for 10 different sites. Um, so the point is, if I understand it, it makes it easier for everybody else as well, because um, I need less technical support. But so far, it's, it's okay. There's just one little glitch um, to do with one of the domains that we're fixing at the moment. Um, mainly how it's been registered onto the site. I'm not sure if they understand fully my question. Because um, the technical support goes to India. Um, it does on the emails um, and the web chat. But I think their live telephone calls actually go to a US call center. Not 100% sure. I have been told it, go, it does, but... Um, we'll wait and see. Uh, hopefully I never have to call it. That would even be better. Um, but yeah, I, the reason I wanted to do this quick video is the fact is it's a dirt cheap package. Um, but if you can, just recommend me on there um, because I'll, I'll get a referral fee. <laughs> but at the same time, uh, why not? It's, you're, if, you're got, if you're looking at getting web hosting for a single site, this is cheaper than you'll get elsewhere. Um, and it's, I think the deal's only for the next couple of days, then they'll be 
uh, taking it off again. There'll probably be some other deal, 25% off for Christmas or whatever. I'm not sure. But I know this, uh, at a dollar a day, a dollar a month, I can't, I can't grumble at it, even if it was just running one website for the next two years. Um, so I just wanted to share that. And also, the, the cPanel interface is pretty good. Uh, sorry, it does, has no cPanel interface. The interface it has is pretty good. Everything's there. Um, it's probably why they've managed to reduce the costs um, in one way, because the licensing on cPanel can, can be quite expensive for um, different accounts. But everything's there, the MySQL databases, the WordPress, whatever, you know, everything is already there, like everything else you would find in cPanel. It's just not where you would expect it to be if you're used to using cPanel. Um, but within an hour, I was pretty familiar where everything was I needed, and I got, got the site up and running. Also, I got the, um, the direct route to the, the site, um, not the .com, because I'm testing the sites before I change my name servers, and everything's uploaded and worked first time. No glitches, sync pretty fast. And looking forward to having no horrible nightmares that I have experienced with some of my previous hosting. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to say give iPage a shout and recommend getting it while, while it's cheap. Okay, thank you.